We want to start with breaking news tonight. Minneapolis police are investigating a second robbery spree of just the day. Yeah, just into our newsroom, sources tell RJ Coles that there have been multiple robberies since 830 tonight in South Minneapolis and possibly Northeast Minneapolis. They go on to say that police were involved in two pursuits within the last hour. One ended with a suspect vehicle crashing. Sources say MPD has made arrests. And Jay Coles has been tracking these robberies all day. He spoke with the police chief right after that first spree happened. Jay? Brett, a lot's happening right now. I am told tonight's robberies were the same type of crimes committed earlier in the day. Juvenile suspects in vehicles robbing people on the street. During the earlier robberies, MPD says no one was hurt. No word on injuries in tonight's robbery spree. Chief O'Hara says three of the six robberies earlier today were at gunpoint. Just before 11 a.m., a 911 operator dispatches Minneapolis police to the intersection of 34th and Lindale South on a robbery call similar to one made just minutes before on West Lake Street. About three minutes ago, a female was robbed. A suspect vehicle was a dark blue car. Three suspects took their wallet. And minutes later, yet another robbery, a few blocks away by suspects, this time with a weapon. The victim was robbed at gunpoint this time. Suspects arrived in a blue station wagon, Leslie Northon in the alley, possibly related to the previous two. Which and just seven minutes later, another robbery, again a few blocks away, with the same description of suspects. The robbery of person 28th and DuPont, three males. All of these robberies in the Lynn Lake neighborhood of South Minneapolis. MPD Chief Brian O'Hara says it happened fast. In the course of 18 minutes, we had four robberies occur within the 5th precinct. And Chief O'Hara says these groups of juveniles were not done. About a half hour later, he says, they hit again. We had a carjacking occur in northeast Minneapolis uh, that we believe is also connected to the pattern that occurred here. And 15 minutes after that, we had an armed robbery occur in northeast uh, as well. O'Hara says the suspects targeted females and were operating together. And the suspects, he says, also connected to a similar robbery spree two weeks ago. This again appears to be the same, uh, same MO, same groups of juveniles that we suspect were involved in the previous robbery spree. Uh, we've had investigators working around the clock to try and identify all of the different individuals involved. And sources also tell me the new protocol put in place by Chief O'Hara was implemented in tonight's robbery spree as well. As in this morning spree, all officers in the precinct who are not on a priority one emergency call were diverted to handle tonight's robbery spree. Also learned the state patrol helicopter assisted tonight. Reporting live in the newsroom, Jay Coles, 5 Eyewitness News.